Hello everyone, this is Marky doing 1990 doing another commentary. Today I got a request from Sundown ICU to play an old NES game made in Japan, never released in America, called Kokoron. Now, uh, it got translated into English by some cool hacker guys, so I gotta thank them. Anyway, let's get into this because I'm sure it is a great game. Uh huh, oh who? Got a funky time, yeah. yeah. It's got a funky tune. Ooh, 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 ooh. Thank you, K2. And we have a blue hippo in pajamas doing his little dance. And a tiny umbrella. What the fuck? Kokoron! Is that the name of this blue hippo? <laughs> Flying in the sky? What? Credits? Did I beat the game already? And and the clouds just turned into umbrellas. What the hell am I playing? <laughs> Dancing penguins, squirrels with moving tails, and lions that dance by blinking their eyes? <laughs> Kokoron. Yeah. That's the game I'm playing right now. <laughs> Oh yeah, translation patch by Akujin or whatever. So we got to thank him. Thank you Akujin. Anyway, let's start the game. Hee hee hee. My name is Tapir. Hello Tapir. I can create any dream. Ooh. I'm the wizard of the dream world. So what kind of dream do you want today? I can tell you right now that I want a dream of racing and me getting in bed. Oh, wait. I'm recording. Fuck. Nobody heard that! A fun dream? Sad dream? Pleasant dream? Well, I don't want any sad dreams. Unless if they're symbolic. Or a magical dream. Well, we gotta have magical dreams, too. Because that's what dreams are. They're magic. And, as we can see here, the blue hippo is the Santa Claus of Dream World because he jumps on your roof and most likely go goes down your chimney. At least I think. This is the magical dream world. Rula, princess of the dream kingdom, has been captured by evil forces. You must go on a journey to rescue her. So it's a classic go rescue the princess story. You are the hero, of course. Well, you can take any form. Ooh, really? Which will you choose? Go away, blue hippo man. I don't need you in my dreams. Wait. Oh! Oh, I can choose my head! That's awesome! And look, they even have Metal Man's head! <laughs> hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna go for the robot head. And for my body? Let's see, we got a, a few options. You know what? I'm going to go for the wing one, because it looks like a dinosaur body. So I'm going to be a robot dinosaur, uh, and for my arms, I'm going to have flowers for arms. So I'm going to be a robot dinosaur with flower arms. And now i got to choose a name. I think that'll suffice. And these are my stats. Ooh yeah, I have a weight of... Holy crap, I am a heavy creature! I need to lose some weight. 506 pounds? Alright, now we are on the stage select screen. Sundown I see you told me not to go to Star Hill because it is one of the hardest places. So I'm gonna go there. Alright. So what we got here is like a Hey, it's the trains from Mega Man 8. <laughs> anyway. This looks like a classic platforming game. Yeah, I collected that egg. And wait. Why do eggs drop hearts? Ah, 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 train! And stars that make earthquakes. And they make pain happen, I assume. Because why else would they do that? Alright. I think I got the hang of this already. So, I just hold the button and I can float temporarily. Alright, just gotta be careful. Alright, <clears throat> let us continue on our quest to collect eggs with hearts in them.
Hey, train, you better watch it. I'm a robot dinosaur. I'm gonna take over the world one day. Did I just get a one-up or something? I can't tell. Uh, there you are, trainee. You have helped me on my quest to get eggs. Okay, I can't sing it. <laughs> this song kicks ass, though. I gotta hand it to the game. Come on, trainee! Aw, you didn't come the way I wanted you. Come on. Ah, there you are, my boy. Oh, what the f what the hell? I don't know what just happened, but I think I took damage. All right. This is a pretty cool level. I don't see why it was considered so hard by the sundown I see you men. Yeah, I'm shooting flower bombs. And I just hurt the train! I just hurt a train with my flowers. These flowers are like hand grenades. What the f- Oh god, oh god, oh god. There are shooting stars everywhere. They are going to make my character ache in pain despite being half robot. Ooh, That was a close one. All right. Ooh! Everywhere. Okay. I, I see now. I gotta collect these hearts to regain my health. Oh my God! It's the moon from Majora's Mask. Oh wait, he's he's Harvest Moon. He must be from the game Harvest Moon. I want to shine brighter than the stars in the night sky, more beautifully than the sun. That is my dream. Fook, fight me! You just tell me your dreams, and then you want me to fight you? Why? I guess by fighting him, I will make his dream come true. Because then I'll make him explode, and then he will, you know, become brighter than the sun. And shit. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, the background's making me all dizzy. Alright, so I already know how to beat, how I'm gonna beat this boss. Alright. I just need to be careful, because he's actually pretty hard. Whoop! 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 I got hit. Alright, I think this brings us down to the final hits! Ooh! Okay. The final blow that decides the fate of the universe is at stake. Yeah! Oh wow, he is shining brighter than the stars! The moon from Majora's Mask has been defeated. Forgive me. A strange wizard said he would grant my wish if I defeat you. Oh, now nice. I see. Alright. That is forgivable. Are you the strange wizard? You're a jerk if you did. Oh, now you're doing your little dance. This game needs a sequel. Alright, create another ally. Ooh, I can create another ally? Sweet. Alright, I think I'll end it here for now. I'll be back soon. Marky Joe 1990, signing out.